Hello everyone, welcome back. In the previous video, you have seen how to create AI chatbot with the help of L Llama Index. So in today's video, we will see how to give the facility to upload the PDF files. You can see here, I have given the facility to upload the files. Means in the previous video, you have seen we how to give the how we have how uh, we have given the web interface, right? But in this video, apart from the web interface, we will give the facility to upload the PDF files. Means the user can upload the PDF files here. Okay, so no need to uh, do any backend things uh, manually. From the front end, we can create our knowledge database, custom knowledge database. Okay, from which our chatbot can give the answers. So here you can see I have already created, I have already uploaded two files, Punjab and Haryana. And now I'm asking the question, tell me the about the Haryana music. Okay, let's see how to do, how to create this one. So let's see. So I'm closing this one. So let's create it from the scratch. So in the previous one, we have created this code. Okay, so you can uh, get this code from my GitHub account. Okay, or in uh, in the GitHub, you will get the uh, latest code. So if you want to see the previous code, you can see the previous commit. Okay, so let's see where to add the things. So I'm just doing copy pasting things. I have already done. I will tell you uh, how to do that means what to do. So this is just a chat interface. Okay, now I'm adding the functionality. Now I'm adding the functionality to add the uh, PDF uploading PDF facility at the in the sidebar. Okay, so this is app one, app one file in the app one file. Here I'm giving the space, and uh, for the uploading purpose, uh, here we have to create a folder like saved path, saved path where uh, where I'm going to save my PDF files. So here data folder. Okay, data folder done. And uh, this syntax. Uh, first of all, uh, make sure folder is created or not. If not, then it will create the folder. Okay, this syntax will create the folder. Next syntax to upload the files. To upload the files. Okay, so here you can see. So this is the syntax. And let me create more space. So you can see upload file st sidebar means in the sidebar we will create the facility this functionality sidebar file uploader choose pdf file type only pdf only pdfs are allowed and multiple files can be uploaded so i hope you get in the sense multiple files true so if you want to upload only a single file if you want to get the facility to upload single file you can make it false otherwise then this one will be a list if multiple files this will be a list so upload files this should be upload files done okay upload files is a list okay so next thing is so if upload files is not none means if list contain something for file in the upload file done Okay, means uh, upload files contain multiple, uh, this is a list which contain multiple files from that file, get the byte data. Okay, and from and open the file name because this is a file, file contain the file name. From that file name, saved path, saved path. This one, okay, in the data folder, save that binary things with this name. Okay, so I hope you get the sense of this syntax write all the byte data whatever we are getting from the file and write file with this name in the data folder means once you upload it our web application take all the data from the file and create a new file inside our data folder okay so i hope you get a sense so next thing is success message success message if files are Uploaded successfully, then give a success message. Done. Directory. And after uploading, create the vector immediately. Create the vector immediately. 
create vector immediately so you you will be amazed from where i'm getting this create vector things let me show you so create vector things so we have to update this first one file we have to update this first one file how to update so here open a key is okay so here make a function def create same name so i'm just copy pasting oh no copy pasting from the app file what is the name create vector save here done perfectly fine uh, this is docs actually so this should not be docs this should be data because we are using data folder okay so here i am going to use a new database that's a vector db uh, by default it store all the things in the storage and storage you can see is already contains something so i'm 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 not going to delete this one so instead i can create my own new folder the slash uh, vector database done okay vector database done and uh, see this one create vector because if i'm using this create vector in the api in the app sorry not api app so we have to import it from here from first 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 one import this thing okay done so in the first one file we have created this we have set this vector database so in the second file in the second one we have to use this folder over here or double quotes okay so now everything perfectly fine now let's run it so in order to run it now it's time to run the code let's run it let's run the code so, so first of all write this stream lit run and file name is app dot so i'm getting this one oh there's some problem with no existing uh, storage kv simple vector database is present okay so here what to do in this case so if you run this one let's run it so i'm getting this error error is saying that this kind of database is not present okay and this uh, date and this error is coming from which file you can see this second one file second file so what to do in that case just uh, do some amendments in the second file second file this one copy paste all the things control x over here to here one more error is there that in the app file we haven't import the os module so let's import it done okay now let's run now it's time to run the code let's run it run the code so once i run it so this is a url let's copy it paste i have all done so it's you can see it's uploaded pdf file save the directory just getting the by default message and you can see here in the data folder no file is present and uh, in the uh, vector database it just created the black files uh, one one kb file something is there okay so let's upload the files from uh, from the this one upload it done so it done vector is created so you can see you can see the size of file vector files and in the data folder you can see both files are there yes uploaded successfully and now let's ask uh, let's ask the question hi tell me the music of haryana Okay, so I'm getting some answers. So let's match it with our database. 
सो कैन सी आंसर इज देसी हरियाणी फॉक म्यूजिक फॉर्म ऑफ हरियाणी म्यूजिक बेस्ड अपॉन राग भैरवी राग भैरव राग काफ़ी एंड इन अवर डॉक्यूमेंट आई हैव रिटर्न एग्जैक्ट सेम देसी हरियाणी फॉक इज़ अ फॉर्म ऑफ हरियाणी म्यूजिक बेस्ड अपॉन राग भैरवी राग भैरव राग काफ़ी सो इट इज़ गेटिंग द डेटा फ्राम अवर कस्टम नॉलेज बेस वी हैव गिवन द एक्स्ट्रा फैसिलिटी हेयर टू अपलोड द फाइल्स एवरी टाइम वैन यू अपलोड इट इट अपलोड्स दी इन द डेटा फोल्डर एंड प्रीवियस फाइल्स ऑल्सो प्रजेंट ऑल्सो प्रजेंट एंड इट विल क्रिएट न्यू डेटा बेस अगेन री राइट इट अगेन नोट द पेन री राइट इट अगेन ओके सो आई होप यू एन्जॉय टडेज वीडियो बाय बाय एवरी वन बाय बाय प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल प्लीज़